to be in the, the the brotherhood that you're part of, the electric school. Oh, okay, IBW, Local 11. Hey, and, let me um, get the hey, let me get this call from Alex. Call back, bro, because he's called a bunch of times. Let me get send it that pick. Hey, hold on, Alex. What up, my G? You lie, What's baby. Up? Alex, what I up? actually, hey, bro, I actually hung up on the caller right before you just so you we can get you in, bro. So <laughs> talk to us. I know you got I know you got some you got some words. Yeah, man. Look, put, to put it in, in simple terms, if someone comes into your house, okay, and says that you know a book says that this is my house now, I'm gonna lock you up. You can't leave the house. I'm gonna I'm gonna serve you dirty water. I mean, this is what's been happening to Palestine in the past 75 years. See, you're talking about what happened on October 7, but no one talks about what happened in the past 15 years. Yeah. I've been an activist for 13 years, and I've been seeing nothing but bombing on Palestine for the past 13 years. In 2014, 2,000 Palestinians were killed, and nobody talked about it. But now that, you know, what is the, what is the saying? Resistance is justified when people are occupied. And now that this happened on October 7, everyone wants to, you know, uh, play victim. Now I have a question for for the dude that was uh, that's your guest. Sticks. Uh, what what happened to the 40, 40 beheaded babies that was spread across the whole world that that had happened on October seven? Was that true or not? Okay, so first of all, I could say the same thing as far as it's 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 been back and forth. And like I said, I'm not here to defend Israel, bro. I'm here to speak what my stance, what my belief is, and to bring a different perspective from what the media puts out there. I agree with you. There's a lot of uh, things that are happening and have happened that shouldn't go be happening on both sides. We can't if 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 like me and Lucky were talking about if someone were to come into our house and do what Hamas did. Okay, there was over a thousand people, bro, women and children that were taken literally as hostages. And then these guys are. You didn't answer my question. I'm going. I'm getting there. I'm getting there, bro. I'm I'm about to get there. And, and this happened, so uh, I'm, I'm going to, like Lucky said too, everything's out the window, bro. There, there, there has to be a response. Now, now, as far as Israel, they've taken a lot of hits as well, bro, throughout the years, and they never moved on them the way they are now. This was like the final straw. Now, as far as babies, 40 ba- I. I don't, I don't know what you're talking about specifically. Maybe you can send me, uh, find me on IG and you can send me some 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 stuff uh, so I could be more aware, but I'm not here. I think, to- it was, I think it's what they said initially happened on October 7th is there was like 40 beheaded Israel babies, Jewish babies. Is that what you're talking about, Alex? Yeah. And, and you're and asking, and, yeah, okay. So he's asking, where's the evidence of that? And we haven't had any evidence of really anything besides okay, hostages they, they, being taken you, and people and, and secondhand information that's been pushed forward I, I like, from I, us of what happened out there. And we don't know for sure if that happened or I not can, because it's... I can lead him somewhere, okay? If you go to Amir Stafari, bro, A-M-I-R, A-M-I-R, uh, and then his last name is Safari, T-S-A-R, something like that. You'll find him on Telegram because he can't put that stuff on social media. He puts so much stuff, actual evidence, bro, of things that have happened both sides, bro, on both sides. And he puts it out there. He's actually, he is a, a Jew, but he's a Christian. And, Wait, and, uh, and have you seen 40 beheaded babies? Though? That's my question. Did, no, I, I, no. I answered you. I answered that already, okay. bro. All right, so what, one, another question. How many times has the Bible been edited? The Bible hasn't been edited, bro. It's been translated from Hebrew and Greek to different languages, okay? And the, everything that I've been speaking about, it's, like I said, history, secular history has validated so much. Even Israel being back in their land after 2,000 years is evidence that the God of Israel, Yahweh, he is god and that he can give us the future in advance bro now you don't have to believe that that's your own personal choice i believe what i believe because of what i've been through in my life my studies my research uh salute to you for what you do bro i'm actually a a a a supporter of what you do uh but we're all gonna be we're all gonna think and believe differently bro Uh, like i said i'm not i'm not here to to uh, uh necessarily defend Israel, I'm here to speak truth that I believe is the truth, bro, and give a different perspective. Okay. I don't just jump on the bandwagon because the media shows me a bunch of different things. The media's been shown to lie to us, bro, time after time I mean, after time again, and people are influenced through that. I mean, well, the media is owned mostly by Jewish people, yeah. and a lot of Palestinian anchors have been fired 
ever since the war. But one last question: um, is is it is the modern Israel the same as the ancient Israel? The the mo- the you mean the people or the land? I'm talking about modern Israel. When you're talking about Israel versus Hamas, so that they haven't all, all of it. All of all of the land is not there. They, basically, they've gained, they've lost land, they've gained land. That's a whole other discussion. Even Gaza, they gave it up. They actually gave it up. They used to actually, as you would say, occupy that land, right? Mm-hmm. And they actually gave it up as to show, like, hey, we we want to be at peace here. And you know what Palestine said. Uh, not the whole Palestine, but the leaders, they said they rejected it, bro. They said, nah, they don't they don't want Israel to exist. And and in fact, the, the goal, as I mentioned earlier, of Hamas is to completely annihilate women, children, all men of Israel to where they cease to exist from this earth. Okay, so, is so that true, you, Alex? Up, well, first, first, it's simply wrong because the modern Israel and ancient Israel are two different things, bro. Okay. Um, ancient Israel was a theocratic monarchy. Um, and the modern Israel, while making special, uh, it makes a special uh, provision for Jewish citizenship. It's uh, it's a secular, uh, liberal democracy. Okay. And did you know that Israel actually created Hamas in the eighties? Uh, no. To your first, to your first comment, uh, I believe there is some some truth to that. Uh, but but I wouldn't say okay. I would well, I wouldn't well, say. And we could be here and de- we could be here and debate this all day. I'm okay. not here. To debate, well, I'm letting uh, you talk but way you're, more than I'm talking, bro. Real quick, uh, I know you're letting me a, talk. A limited you're, time. you're letting like, me talk. <laughs> several, Come on, several, bro. Several, several, several Israeli officials have confirmed. Okay, like Yitzhak Sejev confirmed that Hamas was actually created by Israel. Okay, okay, that's and, if you choose actually, to believe that, that's fine. Okay, but in hindsight, like I mentioned, okay, you can't occupy people for 75 years and bomb them and and. Uh, Leave them in inhuman. You believe in God, right? So, did you hear what the Pope said this morning? I don't care about the Pope. Like I said, bro. Like I said, uh, uh, I'm not name. here to debate anybody about what I'm here to speak. What I'm, what I'm, what I'm here to speak, bro. The truth that I believe in, whether people accept it or reject it, that's on you, bro. You're, you're yeah, whole, well, look, look, what did the Pope say, look, Alex? You're not gonna, con- you, you're, you're not gonna convince me just Pope, because you have your stance. I don't really in, in Gaza right now. The Pope said that what's going on in Gaza right now is terrorism. Because, look, men lie, women lie, numbers don't, bro. For the past 15 years, from the fact is that Palestinians have been getting bombed and killed, and nobody says nothing. And now that it happens to Israel, everyone's playing victim. It's like okay. you watching someone get beat up. Hold on. It's like you watching someone get beat up, and then finally someone steps up and punches a bully back, and now the bully's playing victim, bro. That's exactly what's happening right now. See, we fell for the lies of 9-11. We fell for those lies that we thought that, you know, we were the victims, and we weren't. And you've seen that it was all over oil right now. Right now, if you see what's going on with, with Gaza, all right, there's a there's a reason. There's a 500 mm. billion reason to be subjugated. This is all over oil, bro. This is this is simply mm, what they're doing. What happened in Because the United States created Taliban as well. Okay, I, I understand what you're saying, bro. Like I said, I don't believe everything you're saying is true, but I do agree on, on some of the things. Like I said, I do not agree with everything Israel has done or will do in the same way. I don't, I stand for, I stand for this country cause I love this country It's from where I'm from. I'm from LA. I love my people, bro, but I don't agree with everything that the government has done, including the whole nine 11 thing. That's a whole nother topic, bro. Now, now yeah, so, I can, and, and I can like sit I said, here. Li- hold on, hold on, hold on real quick. I can, we can sit here, bro, and go back and forth. Well, the, you saying that, that Palestine has been, attacked all that in the same way i i can hit you with all kinds of facts as well about the people of israel just taking hit after hit after hit as well i don't need to bro i've been here i've been (laughs) i've been here speaking what i've been saying bro i'm not here to to uh convince you of anything alex if we could ask you what are your thoughts on the hamas group what are my thoughts well that's resistance you know when when you when you have someone and you're occupying them, and you're forced, and you're 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 being inhumane towards them, where they can't they can't even fly out their country. They have no sort of freedom. That's what's going to rise up, whether Hamas exists or not. That's what's going to happen. I mean, it's yeah, resistance. Yeah. So, 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 you support Hamas uh, res- uh, in in the resistance of coming over to Israel, and and if it comes out true of the beheaded, the rape, and all that, you support that because that's just what Israel did to themselves. Well, it's, yeah. it's, I mean, that question that question is a, rhetoric, a, a rhetorical question because I, I could ask you the same thing. Do you support 
what happened in 2014 when they bombed and killed 2,000 Palestinians. Before no, I don't happened. support that, bro. I don't. I mean, that, that's what I happened. don't. I don't support that, bro. Nor do so I. Now can, now, it, so now can you remember, ha- now can you answer remember, the question? On, we have to remember that we're here. Israel is attacking a country with no army. They have no army. Yeah, they just have like militants essentially, right? Who's so that? They have nothing. Palestine. They yeah. have nothing. They just have yeah, like, they have nothing. Yeah. All, they, all they want is freedom, and that's that's yeah. what's going on right and now. It's, so, and, it's, and it's cold the way the, the, well, the way they say that that Israel is controls their water, controls their power, but Israel doesn't completely surround uh, the Gaza Strip. Isn't there Egypt right there yeah. as well? Doesn't and, Egypt? And Hamas, is, Hamas is funded. So what is by Egypt? Iran? What is Egypt doing for them? You know, Egypt is keeping exactly. them at bay that, too. That's another point. A lot of yeah. the Arab. And what Egypt, about Egypt, bro? They've actually rejected. Uh, from no. people coming from Israel Palestine to, to Arab. Egypt. Hold on, bro. Mm. Be- has- go ahead, go ahead. No, no, Israel bombed the entrances when they were going to receive help from Egypt. And no, I'm just talking on. about before all these bo- the war. Like, what is Egypt? Egypt has kept a tight border on the Gaza. I mean, well, you have to understand. You have to understand when anyone that wants to defend is- a Palestine, you have to understand that when you're going at it with Israel, you're going at it with the United, United States, States of America, yeah. who has the largest military in the world. So it's hard. Yeah, yeah it's the place hard... the place that keeps you safe. Hamas has been funded by <laughs> Iran as well, bro. And they're the funded... reason the reason why we're here, the reason why we uh, why Guatemalans and Mexicans are in this country is because the U.S. overthrew our government. I mean, yeah. I would be in Guatemala yeah. right now if, if the Guatemala government wasn't overthrown by the United States. Well, the United States is the is the is the what is it the the big bully. The, the 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 fat guy who's been living but off it's very still well. it's Eating still the meat. place that keeps you safe though bro alex what do you <laughs> alex if i could ask you this what would you see would be uh like a a resolution to this want, yeah you can go wherever you want yeah it's, 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 want, it's, so, it's sovereignty it's sovereignty that's what that's what palestine wants no more regulating them no more dictating what how they live that's it they want they want freedom where do you want to yeah, be? but it's like I mean, at, at some point, right? Like, obviously, uh, Britain gave them their land. They gave up their like they gave them their land to the Jewish people, right? Um, so, how much of that land do you think they really want back? If it can, I even. mean, well, Palestine, Palestine has been scooted over. They've been stealing yeah, right? their land. Israel has been has been taking and taking and taking, and that's what Palestine wants. They just want sovereignty. They want their own freedom. They want to be left alone. Wow, that seems pretty like a pretty easy solution, right? It is. It is, but like I said, there's a five hundred billion dollar reason why they want that. Oh, Gaza. because they want the canal to put the uh, yes. commercial ships through that canal now. Yes. Right. That's the real reason. So they're saying the reason is that the uh, Gaza, there's a canal there, and they want to control that canal to bring and in commercial ships. Uh, they're already planning so what the, they're going to do with that land now. So, so yeah, so Uncle Sam could get his cut, which is America. But there's, but there, but what I'm hearing, and check it out, we, everything we get is second, third, fifth, hundredth hand information, right? What I'm hearing though is the U.S. is telling them, or there's pressure being put that if Israel is not going to occupy the Gaza Strip, and if they, if they, if they thinking of that, there's going to be repercussions. The United States is just as guilty as Israel. The United States needs to get out of that too. Well, yeah. because they want, because they want a cut of it, right? I mean, if- I mean, like I said, we fell for the 9/11. We fell for all the. I mean, do you have veterans right now talking shit to Bush, confronting him every time, every time, every chance they get, or them going to war? It was all fake. It was all over oil. It had nothing to do with anything. Yeah. The hijackers were from Saudi Arabia. They were not from Afghanistan. They were yeah. not from Iraq. You know, and so it, it, and what Lucky said that the United States is keeping me safe. They wouldn't need to keep me safe if we didn't. We wouldn't continue to create so many enemies. Mm, that is true. I mean, we do create the most enemies, but we do have a giant target on us. We're big, fat, wealthy, and arrogant. I mean, it's, regardless of if, like, of course, like it's a it's a democracy, freedom of speech, and there's a lot of things that we're not going to agree with what this country does. But is there another country that you would like to go live in? That, that's my point, bro. There's I I, I, I don't agree with me. That. I ain't trying to go nowhere else. Yeah. Everybody's here. And most people that you actually come somewhere ag- else, you'd be there. Yeah, most if you people, wanted to be somewhere else, you'd, you'd be there. Most yeah, people, exactly. exactly. Most people that come sure against that. our country. They, if they were really, why, why, why are you, why are you here then? I mean, well, we, we I'll tell you why. I, like I told you, here I'm not gonna get overthrown by the U.S. If I go to Guatemala, we're gonna get overthrown again, like we did in 1954. But you'll yeah, be staying yeah, true to your land. Right. You'll be staying true to your land, and you'll be staying true to your people, and you'll be in the real fight for what you believe but in. But, but, but if you look so at so you're, you're, you're taking the easy way out, being right we're here. Indigenous then. and going and talking about that, we our raza is more than 65 percent indigenous, but yet we're over here praising what the the religion from the colonizers. We're praising. I mean, the only reason why the Bible is, is successful and popular is because it invaded eighty-five percent of the world. 
Latin or America is a giant not true, supporter, bro. <laughs> Yeah, Latin America. They actually we, have a lot of numbers in Latin America, though. That's true. I mean, a no, Latin no, America's they, all as, converted. As far as he mentioned something about the Pope, right? Bro, I believe yeah. the Pope is an evil man, bro. I don't stand with nothing okay. that he represents. That That's one thing. Yeah, the Pope's has, a lame. Has, 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 uh, that fool the just, Bible sent me, that fool and, just sent me some dick pics right now, bro. <laughs> hey, ha, has the Bible <laughs> and religion and all that being used for evil? Of course it has, bro. But the Bible goes before the colonization. It goes be, beyond all that, bro. The Bible is a Middle Eastern book. It's our, not our a European book. Not now, if the, Europe, the, Bible, if the Europeans... The Bible. Hold on, bro. I didn't even interrupt you when you were talking. If the if the Europeans used the book to do whatever they wanted to do, that doesn't that doesn't necessary that doesn't mean that the book is not true. That means that they used it, they weaponized it. Yeah, and in the same way, in the same way, bro, true. America, I said it from the beginning. I don't agree with half. I used to be considered. I used to be kind of like you, bro. Like I consider myself a rev, a revolutionary, bro. I was into all the 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 uh, Black Panthers, bro. All You're the talking. all that stuff, bro. Che Guevara, all that. I was heavily into a lot of that stuff, so I know where you're coming from. But the point—I well, don't know what the, happened because you the, lost your way. Oh, yeah, no, I, I found. I actually, I actually found my way. Uh, you need actually, to turn around. I actually found. No, nah, I actually found my way, bro. Fucking Siri. I, it, you know, but but I mean, I'm not. I'm not disrespecting you, bro. I ain't. I ain't throwing nothing. We can speak in person if you like. You can. You're free yeah, to hit I me mean, up. Look. And, uh, and we but, can continue the conversation, bro. But I'm not here to throw a uh, jab at you at what you believe or none of that, bro. Uh, look, I'm here. It's I, just that today's it. podcast, it seemed, it seemed very yeah, biased. And it yeah, seemed like you were justifying Yeah, bro, the but I'm speaking. Bro, when you were on here, when you were on here, people were coming against you. Does that mean that what just because there there's backlash that what you're saying is not true? You can't you can't go off of that, bro. It doesn't matter. I'm here to speak. Uh, obviously, I'm not going to I'm not going to speak for all these different views. I have one stance i have my perspective and that's what it is it doesn't well, matter plain and simple plain it, and simple it, i would like for you to debunk the fact that in the past 15 years i would like for you to debunk the fact that more israels have been killed when in reality I, more palestinians have been killed i don't need to i don't need to debunk narrative? nothing bro because i'm not here for you i'm here to speak what i came to speak i'm not i'm not here for uh alex enamorado bro you didn't invite me I, lucky invited me here to speak and and so that's you know what I mean I don't need okay, to prove I mean, nothing to you. Your answer, where you can you can I didn't say I can. Like I can. I said I'm not. I'm not here for that, bro. I'm not I here mean, to. I'm not here like to it. let you pull I, my I think strings, you bro. I'm not. Headline with the headline I ain't your, I, I'm here. not here to allow you to pull my strings, bro. Like I said, if you want to have a conversation in person, we could do that. I think okay. Yeah, yeah, uh, like I said, uh, I, I think you forgot what the headline said. Yeah, okay. Israel versus Hamas, and it, it, it looked very biased. And that's that, it. We're, I'm is that, was that, did, did I, I make the flyer? You know, I didn't no, even no, make no, the no, flyer, no. bro. I, I made that, and and I didn't think about it till afterwards that maybe that sounds biased. You know what I mean? Because I wasn't. That wasn't my intention to be biased. It was just to have a a, a stance, a fair stance, bro. And in a conversation, bro. And I and I did that. He didn't say, "Hey, put this." I put that. Yeah. You know, yeah, because so. that's like someone saying that's like someone saying, "Oh, Palestine versus the KKK." And now imagine if if another country wants to bomb the shit out of us because they want to look for the KKK, would you justify them killing our babies because they're looking for the KKK because they're hiding in the basement? Yeah, I don't justify I don't justify any babies being killed, Alex. But like we said earlier, and it's in you can look it up in history, brother. That there's there's kids and innocent civilians killed in every fucking war, dog. Yeah, but like I said, this war is not justified at all. It's, it's it's it will no war is just a that's why, <laughs> Yeah, that's there's why no no not killing take part in like the international is, court. The UN, all the reputable human rights groups have called out Israel, and that's why they don't take part in the international court because they know what they're doing is war crimes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sure there's a lot of war crimes just in every two war. Brothers yeah. who disagree, huh? Yeah, that's what it is, go. right? Two brothers it's who disagree. Isaac and what next was time, his other next name? time we start with the bay, the bay right there, right in there. Maybe, maybe bring back legs there after we smoke them right there. <laughs> <laughs> you know what, Alex? You know what? I, I love everything you do on the streets, brother. You know what I mean? And uh, you know, sometimes we may not. Uh, you know, bro, I'm not. I'm not. Uh, how do you say it, bro? We said earlier how I said earlier. Um, I'm not fucking with, with this history, it. bro. Oh. But I just try to. I really try to look at everything, you know, in, in a level-headed way, and I, you know. I mean, that's all we can do, bro. 
you know. Seems but like you this also only listen to conservative hosts. You also listen to conservative hosts, so that, that also plays a part in the way Conserv- you say too. Con- yeah, conservative hosts. You know what? The more that I, the more that I grow into, uh, like the person that I am, I'm starting to realize that. Uh, I used to I used to really lean toward if if in regards to politics, even though I hate talking about politics and all the other shit, because I feel like we have no control in the politics because we are at the bottom of the mountain. Um, and all, everyone is all the white dudes are looking down at all these motherfuckers scratching, pulling hair and clawing, tearing each other up. And they're laughing, bro. And they're like, look at these fucking idiots right here. That's how I see politics. But the more that I I, I, I listen to them, I'm starting to realize that I'm starting to lean towards a little more of a conservative way on on some subjects and then there's some ways that I'm on the left you know I don't know bro I'm just I don't I ain't trying to ah man it's it's this is these subjects are are tough bro it's and just it just divide sucks, but and it's, conquer it's, that's yeah, the point it sucks at the bo- I can't even speak on it right bro because I don't I really don't have these conversations Alex you know I just it's out of, it's out of it's out of my it's out of my lane sort of, in a way bro but I I they're important to have though they're important to have and I'm not trying to have like one side and not have the other on the platform. So, you know, bro, yeah. if you want to come on and speak on it, bro, we can get you on, baby. You know what I mean? It's easy, like dog. Like we'll, we'll bring back Lex Sunday. We'll yeah, it. yeah, we'll do it, dog. <laughs> so you like, free like, on Sunday? Alex, you, hey, Alex, you know I'll, su- I'll support you, brother. You know what I mean? And and, and I want to have I want to have a, a fair uh, battleground if this is what it is, you know, or a fair, uh, you know, both sides, you know, like, bro, we, we, we get that, bro, and I'll give you the stage easy, you know? For sure. Yeah. All right, y'all. Free pilot sign. All right, baby. All right, Alex. All right, late. Hey, something Casey said actually.